In this video, we're going to talk about what multi-body modeling is all about and what it can help us do inside of Autodesk Inventor. So we have a whole series of videos here that talk about different techniques involving what's called multi-body. Now, a multi-body technique is essentially a way of creating multiple solids inside of a part file with the intent of one of two different things. Number one, you're trying to create separate solid bodies that you would represent as separate IPT files inside of an assembly. So we have an eventuality of being able to generate and create solid bodies in context of each other inside of a single part for ultimate control and then turning that into a assembly file. And then they can also update based on how the multi-body file changes. Or number two, we might create complex shape with our multi-body modeling tools or special design tasks. So we're gonna start off, again, by looking at how to generate a simple solid body. Afterwards, we're gonna move on to how to work with solid modification tools and solid duplication tools inside of a IPT file. After which, we're gonna take a look at some more complex tools for modification, such as a combined tool to take multiple solid bodies and create the complex type of design scenarios that we need to visualize to our clients or to our shop personnel, such as creating cores for the insides of castings. And lastly, we'll take a look at working with very complex shape that when we try to create inside of Inventor with normal tools, we just run into roadblocks. So we're going to take a look at how to get around these brick walls that we might run into with out-of-the-box modeling techniques. So this has been an introductory look at what you can learn about with multi-body modeling. 